Last question. Um, Theresa May said after your meeting that she wouldn't want to trigger Article 50 until all parts of the UK felt uh, comfortable with that, which clearly includes you and Scotland. Um, does that mean that in some senses you have a veto now over when Article 50 will be triggered? Because until you're comfortable, if, the, if it's not going to be triggered, the negotiations don't start. Well, that certainly appeared to be an interpretation that some put on the Prime Minister's remarks after the meeting. And, you know, certainly from what she said after the meeting, I think that puts Scotland now in a very, very strong position. And it puts me in a strong position. Of course, it puts a responsibility on my shoulders to think through what the options are. We've already started that working to see if we can bring forward options that effectively okay, square so, this so circle. You think you have some, possibly some kind of veto in your back pocket, should it come to that? I, I think we're in a very strong position, and that's a position. I'm going to use as, uh, as well as I can.